So I think you know the relationship that the Enchas and Microsoft have that goes back you know many years. We've been a gold partner of Microsoft, as you know, for a while. We've worked on joint R and D um, in in the U.S. Uh, R and D labs for a while. Um, I think that's important because it, it, it gives us an insight into where you're heading, where your roadmap's going, where your thinking's going, and vice versa. You understand sort of the, the problems, I guess, that we deal with from a customer interaction management space. And when we look at the first line worker initiatives that, that Microsoft has and how that dovetails with what, what Enchouse is doing, there's a good there's a good alignment, I think, mm -hmm. with, with what we're doing. Absolutely, and, and uh, as I say, we are on a journey now from uh, Skype for Business to Teams, and, and you've been as, on the full journey, and, and now you've been in the our TAP program as yep. one of the early adopters yep. uh, into Microsoft Teams. And as you said, Microsoft Teams is actually adding another layer for performative behavior yep. uh, for when we work in the modern workplace, right? So. Yep. From, from not only having a communications channel, now we have the network-based collaboration yep. where we need to connect all the intelligence that are in the organization. And if you're in the contact center, you need to get the skills and the expertise from wherever people are, right? So, yep. so by help of connecting Enshows and and Microsoft in, into Teams collaboration space together yep. with Trio, for example, yep. it's, it's where magic happens, I think. Mm -hmm.